Hello there, come play Super Meat Boy with us, internet. That was a really bad opening. I have no clue where I was going with it. All right. Leave it. We're going for it then. <laughs> yeah. I was like, all right, zany voice, here I mean, we go. Honestly, most of our openings are bad. Yeah. Like, we can talk about that for a little while. I always, I feel like every opening should be something more than just, hello, welcome to Super Eats the Replay, boy, live. But we have reasons, right, for doing it the way we do, because you want that sort of branding. Yeah. Like, it's this weird duality of wanting to entertain, but also wanting to get recognition. Ooh. Um, one of the hardest things to do is get, you know, noticed by people who have this huge flood of... Uh, Let's Plays available for them to watch. I mean, there's hundreds. We've, you know, the th hundreds is not enough. Thousands. Um, we've met so many Let's Players since we started doing this and learned of so many more that we haven't met. Um, I always knew it was big, but I had no idea how big the Let's Play community is. And so you have, you have two jobs. One is catch the attention. And the other one is somehow... Establish yeah, establish an identity so they'll come back. Because if they don't come back, what's the point, right? Like, just because you caught their attention once doesn't mean anything. So how do we do that? <laughs> like, this is this is our, our behind-the-scenes episode of Instant Replay Live. How, how do, Joe? It's interesting, because this is something I've been talking to on, like going out and talking to people in the forums about how they let's play and stuff and there's so many different opinions on, on everything from mm -hmm. what should your thumbnails look like to you know yeah. how do you brand every opinion you come across you'll find completely contrary advice from different people I, and I think like I think the characterization is key I think um, I, I, I wonder though like maybe we have a different opinion here you know being able to say instant replay live at the start of episode seems good mm -hmm. but saying it I guess I guess if we're if we're if we're switching characters every week or every day, it's not a it's not a consistent thing though. So I don't know. Uh, my thought kind of broke away into a series of self doubt. Of self doubt. <laughs> How that's do another. I do that? That's another hard part about being on a let's play is all the self doubt, right? Like, no, I'm. I, I mean, I'm. I'm amazing. So whatever. Okay. Well, never mind. <laughs> I was gonna say like. I'm just trying so, to get to this level. So many of us. <laughs> and this applies to so many of our friends who are Let's Players as well. Like, there is so much. Um, there, there's so many of us. And by definition, most gamers... Well, not by definition. I shouldn't say that. Statistically speaking, most gamers are pretty introverted, right? Like, we're we're introverts. And, and we want to be friends with other introverts. That's We've kind of added it as a tagline now for our show because of... A quote from my boss that we're instant friends for introverts. <laughs> um, I started including that in all the descriptions for the videos, nice. by the way. I don't know if you've noticed. Uh, I, I did, but I, I was like, where did that come from? Uh, yeah, it came from my, my boss. It was pretty cool. Um, so, super into that concept, but where I was going with this is as introverts reaching out like this is is obviously not our natural state. Not mine, anyhow. Yeah, I know you said you're perfect, whatever, blah, 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 but it's not my natural state to, to be an animated character or anything. I just wanted to share what our gameplay is like, right? Like us hanging out together and sharing games with other people. Sure. And we're doing that effectively, but we want to share it with more people. And if you want to share it with more people, you kind of have to become something else. <laughs> and that's... That's weird. Like, is that what is that? What is that? What was superhero movie where, where they were like you have to become a, become a symbol? It's Batman. Oh, the it's the yeah, it's all Batman. More. Yeah, yeah. Um, I can I can see that. Uh, I, I feel like I've had a really weird uh, arc with how I feel about myself as an extrovert or an introvert. Mm -hmm. Because up until maybe my freshman year of college, I was very extroverted, and I was like, oh, let's go meet people, let's go have fun, let's go talk to everybody. And if, you know, I, I'm willing to talk with people who aren't in my clique at school or whatever. It's cool. There's there's people to talk to. Yeah. And I got really sucked into my own crowd, and I was just like, these are the friends that I want to spend most of my time with. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. I, I just kind of bitterly shoved everything else aside. And um, I got like the more I just got more and more zoned into that, where I was really just focused on a few of my friends, and uh, kind of became introverted. And now this is kind of like me getting out of my shell again, talking to people on the internet. Well, it's definitely getting me out of my shell. I would normally just judge everyone silently. <laughs> And uh, 
and never, you know, like interact. And now we're we're interacting with so many people and learning so much about so many cool people. It's it's weird. It's weird for me. But I imagine it's weird for lots of Let's Players. Um, that, that, that a large number of us are introverts and that we're all sort of facing the same struggle of how do I say, look at me, look at me, when I'm also kind of shy and awkward. Oh. Oh, Joe, why, don't go... <laughs> you can't go back. <laughs> you can I, never go well, back. Well, there is one Kate. I can go back to. Uh, all right. But Because uh, the one right there doesn't, the, doesn't like change. Like the straight drop down? Oh, I see that one. Um, yeah, well, that one's fine. But it's still hard because the, the, when you're moving, you have momentum, and if you're in the air, you can't really stop it. Yeah. But so. I think you can't try to double back, and you can't try to... Um, well, if I, if I miss the jump, there's no way to go but to try to stop myself from dying. Yeah. Because... I, you, you're more... <laughs> fine. Fine. I, I think you're going to die anyway. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But I mean, I'd rather try not to die and try to, you know... Yeah, I think you need to go later on this jump, too. Yeah, I do. I just always feel like it's sooner. Yeah, I can, I can imagine. Um, oh, Jake just came out of the uh, the other room there. And Rachel's using the sink. I'm sure that's going to sound good. <laughs> oh. Oh, Ooh. all right. Okay. Jump off the edge now. <laughs> what was that? Jump off the edge now. <laughs> yeah. Over the edge, over the edge, over the oh, edge. Well, I'll show you who can't go back. <laughs> Just do it anyway. Wow. Wow. You kind of, you could almost make it. Like, because you get a little bit of air manipulation, right? You can, yeah. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Oh, he's in a bad uh, spot for you now. Where do I go? Well, not that way. Oh, I was trying to see where that where that key unlocks. Let me go and check it over here. Unlocks to the right. Is it to the right or is it? Oh, over is it here? that? Oh gosh. Well, everything is terrible. Oh, oh, oh there's a thing down what, there. What I even gonna... is that flying head thing? I want to know more about this world. Does it do like a post-credits Mario thing where it gives names to all the monsters? Oh, that'd be great. <laughs> that would be incredible. I really want to know more. Okay, so it definitely doesn't open to the right. So. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Whoa! Yeah, it seems like that is what you're intended to it's do. A great that fun massive jump. jump. Yeah. I don't think so. Really enjoyable. I think it is. My my Assassin's Creed jump. Yeah. Leap of faith. What do they call them? Is that what they call them? The well, what do they they call the per? Uh, I have completely forgotten. It's been a while, quite a while since I've played yeah. Assassin's Creed. It's a leap period. of faith in gaming terms, but no, that's true. They they have a different name in the in the Assassin Creed Assassin, as you said. More ass as possible. Yeah. Thanks, Living Ready Run. What? Uh, I figured if I'm gonna if I'm gonna directly quote another another channel, I should at least oh, give them okay. credit. Okay. Um, ass ass and screed. More ass as possible is a I see. Living Ready Run thing, as well as Mass Effect making masses erect. <laughs> Jesus. That's what I like to say all the time. So better go ahead and credit where credits due. All right. Well. Ooh. He's coming after oh, me, and oh, I don't oh, like it. Oh, oh, he's, he's oh man! Thing. Uh, Massive chunk. I didn't chomp. think I had a way around that. Okay. Ooh. Okay, Joe. Keep it interesting for us. Go. Oh, ha! Ho! Oh, how no, you doing? That's. <laughs> I'm doing fine. I'm a little tired. Oh, okay. Um, uh, are you saying I need to talk, or can yeah. you just put voices to this ghast? Like he's gonna kind of open his mouth every couple seconds okay, here. Okay, hang on. He should be coming after me in a second. You called him a ghast. You, you've declared what he is. Well, somehow. I don't think so because he's not he's not ghostly enough. Ooh, you. Sorry. What is happening? Oh, good. Ooh, doggy poops. Jake is pooping in the floor. Oh, it's in the floor. Ah. Uh, mm, that's gonna smell great. Ooh. All right. Well. Wonderful timing. Uh, we're not ignoring the poop. Rachel is going to clean that up for us. Oh, how do I get through that? That's, that, was, that looks uh, impossible. Joe, watch, your, watch your foot over there. Is it near me? It's kind of near you. Oh, no. I can't look. I can't turn away. It's just straight up poop on the floor. That's the name of this episode. Poop on the floor. Yeah. <laughs> so is this thing Jake's poop? Uh, yeah, I think it is now. <laughs> There's no giving it a voice though, because it only has the one animation. It just kind of goes. Bah. Give it its thoughts then. Its thoughts. Yeah. Hmm. Ooh, what's that? Oh, there he is again. Oh my god. Gonna try to eat him here. I think I can sneak up on him if I just. Oh, he's. Ah, I'm... Oh, I <laughs> ah, ah. <laughs> I just want to give him lots of long. Oh. Dry... Ugh, Joe. 
Okay, this game is slippery, Nick. You're gonna have to deal with it. <laughs> you gotta stop being bad at games. <laughs> do you, I think it's the level where I just give you the controller. All right, let's do it. One try. Here you go. Oh, it's all tangled with my my quai. Oh, that's all right. Go. I can do it. All right, jump. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Run. Is that? That's run. Okay. Is there any other button I need to be aware of? I mean, that's, those are pretty much the basics. All right. You gotta keep talking though. Oh, uh, is that what oh. my job is here? <laughs> yeah. Well, right. that's. That's how this works. I'd right? like to voice this guy's this guy's thoughts. Okay. Oh God. <laughs> I'm just floating through in Rapture City, and oh hey, it's Red <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Why is he Red Jesus? Because he keeps he, coming back. He did just come back from the dead. Yeah. This, okay. this is the plot where you've come back from hell. So he could be he could be Red Lazarus. Oh, uh, that's. We want to get all biblical. Nice. Yeah. Oh, Rachel's back with. <laughs> well, I wouldn't. <laughs> You could uh, easily, that could easily be poop. Oh, God. Joe, this game is hard. Yeah, well, we're in the middle of recording. Hard to talk. I kind of prefer talking now. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I kind of prefer playing the game yeah. now. It's over talking. All right. But, uh, Keep it going, Joe. Well, so, so uh, Nick, how have, you, how have your experiences been playing this game? <laughs> 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 What's it been like just doing all these levels? Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, well, I got to tell you. This game is bullshit. <laughs> oh, oh okay. nice. Well, that was the second time I've landed it. Oh, <laughs> oh, it's Nick, a Nick. Why are you being so bad? It's a boo mechanic. If you look at him, he closes his eyes. Does he? Yeah. Is See, I'm already learning shit about this is game. He a sleepy camper. You can't even know how good I oh. am. Uh, <laughs> Super Meat Boy. I mean, does he like not see you when he's closing his eyes or something? But hang on. Let's get him. Let's get him where we can look at him. Let's just drop down. And then this will be it. Oh. <laughs> Man. Boos are one of my favorite monsters from Mario, actually. Yeah, right? Like, a lot they're of so instantly recognizable and appreci you can appreciate them. Well, the same can be said for many of Mario's monsters. And I feel like there's some of Mario's <laughs> monsters that kind of get lost. Like those great little dinosaur guys from uh, Super Mario World, the blue ones. Yeah, the how come they've never been back? I don't know. I feel like maybe they're just too generic. Maybe. Um, the Koopas had a lot more, uh, I feel like... Uh, okay, he does not have boot mechanics. I was wrong. All right. Well, next time on Instant Replay Live, we'll we'll try this again with Joe back in control, as it as it probably should be. Ooh, ah, oh. Wow, wow. You really kick it. Kick Yo, it. plans, free stroke, Sonic Golf. Sonic Golf.